looks very proper with the button up, doesn't it? Open up the button. Yo! <laughs> you just want to talk some trading? Okay, you might be wondering what I'm doing under the covers. I'm hiding from the Australian dollar. I want to trade it, but I'm hiding in here because the Australian dollar is evil. It wants, it wants me dead. So I'm in here hiding from it. Ugh. Stand that currency trade this week, but I love it and I can't stand it and I love it. Maybe just a little, maybe just a little look at it. No, no. Um, Barry, I'm wearing a dress shirt today. No more t-shirts today, even though it's 157 degrees outside. I'm still wearing a dress shirt. I'm, of course, I'm inside right now. I have an idea, it's not, it's not purely my own, but here's the idea. I have, sitting on my desk now, Just, just this desk, just this one alone. And this is just part of, this is just part of them. Look, on the desk also, we got those. That's a lot of books. <laughs> I mean, this doesn't give me much of a choice, does it? This is like, I don't know, I'm, I'm on my way to a, I, I'm on my way to a date that I, I don't want to go on. And this one, someone else is on the way to a date with me they don't want to go on. This is terrible. It's like, oh. That's a lot of books. Pitbull. I've heard this is a good book. Meditations by Marcus Morelli at Lem Room. Heard that. Natural Born Killers, Natural Born Heroes, the sequel to Born to Run. Started reading this book, literally my mind started blowing up out of my ears like volcano. Pairs trading. I want to write a book called It Takes a Pair to Trade, not Pairs Trading. Or Pairs Trading, like P-E-A-R-S. What am I going to do with all these books? Am I really going to read all these books? An endless supply of books. Endless. How many of these books are necessary? There's a guy named Ty Lopez on the internet, on YouTube. Super inspiring guy. Says he reads a book a day. I, guess, uh, I read a book a day. Is a, a book a day? Are there that many good books? No, no, no. No! No, 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 no! 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 What? I'm struggling with this idea. And I got this from Derek Sivers. Perhaps it's a better choice to choose two or three or four or five books and concentrate on those books for the year and say, Instead of filling my mind with new, why not concentrate on implementing the good information in just a few books? 
that seems like a reasonable idea to me, but what few books would they be? I'd love to, I'd, I got a few of them on the floor. I, I think that one of them is gonna be ego is the enemy and the other one's gonna be the obstacle is, obstacle is the way. I'm not exactly sure about that. If you have ideas, let me know in the comments on this video. I'd love to hear what your ideas for your favorite books or what could be my favorite books this year are. Thank you.